Okay, guys, it's mail time. Now, I received this box yesterday. It is from one of my favorite companies. The folks at Mermaid Whiskey sent me the box. Oh, let me open it up here. And then we can go through it together. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! Pleasantly surprised pink styrofoam. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Very surprised. Likey likey very much. Okay, so oh I love this. Alright, every order she puts out, she puts this out. So you got a bath bomb. And it's all your directions and you know, way to clean up, things and that, if anything, and which really you don't really have to do much cleanup. You just hose the tub down right when you get out. Um, for everyone, when you're dealing with bath bombs, with colorants, with things like that, a lot of times you get out of the tub and it's a very deeply colored bath bomb and the water's black or a blood red or a deep blue. If you get out and the water goes down and you see a little bit of the color resin, rinse it right away. Don't let it sit there and dry because then it's going to become a problem. So, you know, then you have to break out the comet to get it off because even with lakes colors and the perfect colorant, if you let a color dry into your tub, some tubs are not conditioned and they're, they're matte. And guess what? You're going to have an issue. So you might want to do that quick. Okay, then we have the Whiskey Mermaid logo, which I have her listed down below for you. So you guys can definitely go and check her out because unfortunately now I have a bit of a glare here. And there's a kitten eating the box. Stop eating the box, Oscar. Go. Okay, and then I have a card. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'm going to read this real quick and we'll open. Isn't that beautiful? Katrina is so fucking awesome. It's, it's pretty much a thank you card, but it's, you know, it's thank you for being a good customer, things like that. Um, okay, so we're going to go ahead and we're going to open this up and see what kind of goodies she sent. Uh, right off rip, I see what looks like a cauldron. Oh my god, that is so adorable. Oh, and I see candy. Oh, oh, oh. The way to a fat chick's heart, candy. Oh, okay. So you put the little tea light inside here. That is so adorable. Oh my god, that is so friggin' cute. I'm never going to light it, though. I'm actually just going to leave it like that and hang my cauldron. So I have to dig the powder out of the little cauldron bath bomb thingy that I got from Fortune Cookie Soaps. And uh, I just want to keep my cauldron. <laughs> so now I don't have to dig the powder out. Now I can go ahead and keep my cauldron. So that was cute. I like that. I do see some sorts of candy thingies here. <gasps> oh, my God. I used to get these when I was a kid. Oh, my Lord. I used to fight with my dad because we walked on the store for him to go get his cigarettes to buy me these because they, they were always in, like, this round cup. And all their colors were like in separate cups on a counter. I don't know how to say it, but they were, and they were so beautiful. And I fell in love with all of these ones. Oh my God. I love these things. They were always, it's so, such like nostalgic thing, you know, like, I don't know why I love them so much, but it was something with my dad, you know, oh, there's another one. Look, look how cute they are. They're like candy cane. Just, it's like candy cane type candy, but it's just like, it's like lollipop kind of. It's so cool. And when I was a kid, I used to literally... Oh, good, this one's bubblegum. Ooh, bubblegum flavored. Then we have... What was the other flavors here? Peaches and cream. God damn. And then... Black raspberry. Ooh. Oh, my God, there's more. Okay, this one is cotton candy, right? Yep, cotton candy. Wow, that is such, like, a nostalgia thing. Oh, my God, that is so awesome. <gasps> is that wax? Yes! Wax, 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 wax. Oh my god. House of Phoebe, mob wife. <laughs> oh my god. Oh wow. That's beautiful. I almost don't want to melt that, but you know I'm going to. Oh wow. Oh my god. That smells awesome. Is it hard wax? Yeah, it's hard wax. What is the scent? Oh my god. Is it called mob wife? I don't know. It might be. Is Phoebe a mob wife? No, Phoebe wasn't a mob wife. Oh my god, that smells so friggin' good. It's unreal. So good. 
so freaking good. It has like a, a bit of like a red hot scent, but with like a perfumous type scent. So the red hot's not like a bow in your face, you know? Man, I can't wait to melt that. I'm melting that immediately. I have my melter right next to me. Okay, because I have not felt good for the past two days, so I've just been laying in my bed and relaxing. And, oh, there's another one. So I keep the melter right next to me, and I've had, like, uh, mentholy stuff in it and then headachey stuff in it. <sighs> Pink mermaid wax melts. That is so cute. Come, little children. <laughs> Everybody knows the Hocus Pocus rendition, right? Oh, my God, let me smell this. Oh, God, that smells so friggin' good. I don't even know what the hell that smells like. It's kind of citrusy. Oh, my God, it smells kind of citrusy. It smells like something I've had from uh, from Lush. It's not Calacas, guys. No, don't, don't, don't put your panties in a wad. But, oh, my God. Hold on, let me pop one of these in my melter real quick so I can smell them. Uh, I think I'm going to go with Mob Wife. I think I'm going to put Mob Wife in the melter real fast. Hang on one hot second. Damn, before I melt this, take one last look. That is friggin' gorgeous red, and it smells amazing. So let me get my, my thingy here. This wax melter was given to me by my best friend, Nat. And I've got it going now. And yeah, I melted the whole thing. I like to do things big. <laughs> A lot of people just cut it in half and melt it. But I, I like it so much that I don't want to like disturb it, so I'm just going to let it melt down nice and big. And, yeah, of course I have a knife near me. I could have cut it, but I don't want to. Oh, is this monkey poo-poo? Oh, this is so cool. I just saw this on the site, and I was like, I'm ordering this one. This is a Whiskey Mermaid monkey bomb, which I believe is the scent of the monkey doo-doo scent, or monkey poo, or shit. I don't know what the hell it is, but let's smell it. Get a little lift here and take a whiff. Let's, let's smell. Oh my god, it smells so good. Ooh, reminds me of Florida. It's not like a monkey poop scent. It's not monkey doo doo, like I thought it was. Like, you know, that monkey poo that's like a berry ish type scent that I thought was going to be like synthetic banana? No, it's not a monkey poo poo scent. It is monkey bomb, which kind of smells like. Like Florida, like you're gearing up to go to the beach. Um, it smells kind of like, reminds me of kind of like coconut, a little bit of suntan, um, but not like bad. Like I always, I always say I don't like the smell of suntan. It's not bad at all. It smells like it all belongs together. I don't know. It just smells really good. Kind of like banana-esque. You know, I don't know. It just smells good. I like it. Definitely, man, this brings me back to Florida, though. It reminds me of Florida. So if you are missing the heat and you need some warmth and you want to be brought back to, like, you're going to the beach or going to the pool days, go grab yourself one. Okay, sorry, I had a little bit of an interruption there. The telephone did something funny. I like to film with my phone. I like to film with my phone. So it did something funny, so I got kind of bleeped out. But this is an amazing, amazing, amazing bath bomb. I cannot wait to set this bad boy off because it is cold out and I am missing some of that heat. So this does remind me of going to the beach or down to the, like, you know, to the pool or whatever it is, or going outside and getting some sun in, like, the summer months. I needed this. Okay, so that is beautiful. I love the monkey in it, too, holding the baby banana. Okay. I love these pink peanuts, man. I'm going to, like, decorate my desk with these. <laughs> pink peanuts are amazing. <gasps> Oh my god, look at all this cool shit. <gasps> ah! <laughs> I wanted this one. This one's at, this one was actually in my cart. Um, and I just I ran out of cash. I couldn't grab it. Oh my god. What is it called? The Sarah Good Hanged? Sarah Good Hanged, July 19th, 1692, Salem. Oh wow. That's actually an awesome friggin' like thing for the witchy bomb. I like the Salem bomb. Let me smell the Salem bomb. I love the stickers already. In her company, in Whiskey Mermaid, she gets a sticker for each individual bomb. And it just makes it like so unique and so cool. Oh my god, this smells amazing. 
Oh my god, if you see this on the site still, which I'm not sure if it's still going to be there, I think it either left Friday or it's going to be leaving this Friday. Grab one immediately. This smell is amazing. Holy shit, does this one smell good. She has amazing scents. It really does. Man, I am so happy that she sent me this box. Oh my god, I'm so lucky. Okay, let's go through this one real quick, and then we'll go through the cool-looking little ones. Oh, man. I love my horror stuff, so. Oh, my God, look at this box! Look at him, he's a mummy! That is so freaking cool! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, sorry, my, my tummy just, like, gurgled. My apologies, though. I just haven't been feeling too great. Oh my god! I love these! Oh man, these are so freaking cool! I love these, man. I did my last two and I was like, I should have saved one. These are so awesome. I love the crystal eyes. I actually kept my crystal eyes uh, with my last two bombs and they're in my, my book. <laughs> okay, so I don't know the name of this guy, but let's give him a whiff. Oh man. She, she doesn't disappoint. I gotta tell you, man. I really do. I love them. I love Whiskey Mermaid bath bombs. I didn't like them before, but I love them now. Oh, I have one of the small bombs in the same scent. Oh, my God. Oh, God. I have one of the small bombs in this scent. I gotta go grab that small bomb and find out what the scent is. Because it is absolutely intoxicating. I love the smell. This is a type of smell that can go versatile, either masculine or feminine. And it smells amazing. I love the way this smells. But the small bomb has the has the tag on it, and, and it's the same scent. So, yes, I know this scent. I love this scent. Oh, my God. Isn't that so cool? Look at the detail work on that. This mold was incredible. You guys don't realize how hard it is for these bombers to actually get the products to take on the shape. Because this is all dust that gets compressed into it. But if you compress it too hard, it's going to sink and not float. If you compress it too lightly, it's going to fall apart. So there's like a middle ground. So these bombers really put a lot of their friggin' time and effort and heart and soul into making us these products. So I am very impressed. Man, I love these, these skull ones. I really do. I love the box that it came in, too. Look how adorable that is. Oh, good. Okay, let's get more of these peanuts out and get to the other box. Should we do the big box there or should we do the coffin box? I think we should do the coffin box. Move the peanuts out of the way so I can get them out. Okay, got them out. Look how cool this is. Happy Halloween. Look at this box. It's a coffin. And it's hard, too. It's not like... Yeah, you know, it's not going to fall apart on me. That's awesome. I cannot wait to decorate the new home with all this stuff. Peanuts! And worms! We have red worms this time. Tiffany sent me black worms. Katrina sends me red worms. Oh, and there's, looks like there's two things in here. <gasps> there's three things in here. Oh, so cool. Okay, so we have Little Skull. Wow, he is really detailed. Holy crap, man. Okay, let's go. Little, little Skull. Let's smell Little Skull. Oh my god, Little Skull smells amazing. Wow, what is that? That smells so good. Oh my god, Little Skull smells absolutely incredible. I'm so bad at scent, so I can't describe it. It's kind of perfumey, yet floral, yet not kicky in the ass type smell. And right now that I don't feel good, everything's giving me a migraine. This is not giving me a migraine, thank god. It smells so good. It's not a migraine bomb by any means. It smells really, really good. This one is the brain one. It looks like a brain with a little spider on it. <laughs> or a contusion, whatever you want to call it. So these two are brains. That is such a cute little like concept. A little coffin box with the brains in them. I love that. The skull and the brains. That is perfect. And I, I'm a freaking Halloween like nut. Oh, I love the smell. I recognize the smell. I definitely do recognize the smell. I can't pinpoint what it is, what it is, but it smells so amazing. It actually kind of smells a little bit like Richie's cologne. I don't know what cologne it is, 
but he's worn it. He wore it for years when we were younger. Oh my god, it smells so good. It smells like his cologne, but it's not his cologne. You know what I'm saying? But it has like an amazing scent to it. I'm assuming they both smell the same, so I'm not gonna open this one. I just cracked that one open so I can smell them. Oh my god, I cannot wait. I'm so gonna drop these in the tub. Maybe I should do all three of them together, like kind of like cocktail them. What do you guys think? Do you think I should do all three of them together? I think that might make it cool, because this thing, this purple one smells like, like a feminine, like, kind of perfume that I have, that I had. So that's, like, that's what it reminds me of. It's, like, one of the perfumes that I've had. I think it was, like, a Victoria's Secret perfume or something that I had or something. But it smells real. Maybe it was Vera Wang. I don't know. It's, it reminds me of perfume. And this reminds me of one of Rich, Rich's colognes. So what do you think would happen if I did all three of them in together, just, like, drop them like that? Oh, that would be so cool. Maybe I'll do that. You guys tell me. What do you think I should do? I'm all excited now. <laughs> I feel like shit, but I'm like so happy and so excited right now. It's unreal. Okay, now let's go for the house. I absolutely love these houses. These are so adorable and so cute. Look at that. I do not have this one at all. I did collect some of the other ones, and I don't have this one at all. So I was kind of upset with Richie that he didn't grab this one. And now I'm not so mad at him anymore. Isn't that so cute? That is adorable. I love it. <laughs> oh, I love the pink styrofoam. I really do. I think that is a perfect touch. I would keep that. I would definitely keep the pink styrofoam. What is in here? Oh, cool, look, it is Mermadia Sugar Scrub, right, it is a sugar scrub, right, I'm saying that right, it's Becky, I saw this on his site, I wanted to get it, just because Becky, you know, it's Becky with the good hair, you know, like, it's just in my head, so as soon as I saw the name Becky, I was like, it's Becky with the good hair, oh my lord. Ooh, isn't it pretty? Oh my god, it is so pumpkin and so good. Holy shit. You you gotta, you gotta. If you see this on the site, Becky, go get yourself Becky. This is, hey, don't be eating my peanut stuff. This smells so good. Oscar, you want to smell? Come here, buddy. Want to smell? No, we don't want to smell. Don't eat it. Just smell it, dude. You don't know how to smell and not eat. Oh, my God. It has such an amazing pumpkin scent to it. Oh, I'm so using this tonight. I can smell it, too. Like, I'm a little stuffy, but I can smell it. It smells so amazing. Look, Becky. It's Becky with the good hair. See the name down there, Becky? Oh, my God. So good. So freaking good. Oh, now, in case you guys don't know the backstory with Mermaid Whiskey... Whiskey Mermaid, my apologies. Uh, I always say the name backwards. I say everything backwards, and I also put numbers in backwards, so 69 would be 96. Uh, I don't know why I do that. I've been doing it since I was a kid. I'm not dyslexic, though, so I don't do words backwards. Uh, I don't spell backwards, I mean, but I love when they give you the little scoops, too. This is such an amazing gift. Oh, my God, Katrina, thank you so much. I am so blessed to have amazing people in my life. I really am. Thank you so much, so, so much, Katrina. This is so adorable and so perfect. I'm so happy. But I'm telling you guys, though, you have to get Becky. You have to. Becky is like the best pumpkin scent I've ever smelled. It smells so friggin' good. And that is a huge sugar scrub. Huge. Move, Oski. Get out of the way. Get, 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 get. Go, go, go. So Oscar, the little pain in the ass that he is, is going to torture me now. Because he wants the worms. Here, have the worms. They're for you. Okay. See, Katrina sent you a gift too. Sent you worms. Uh-huh. <laughs> but... I can't believe how cute this is. I can't believe all these cute little things she sent. This is so amazing. This is so perfect. Oh my god. So cute. So adorable. Here, Oscar, you can hold that one too, buddy. There you go. Just bury you in there. <laughs> Isn't that so cute? Oh my god, they are so adorable. Do not knock my stuff down, dude. I am so happy. Oh, and I was I was feeling like shit too. 
So I'm so excited that I got to open these goodies. And she sent me this stuff, man. I love you. You are so good to me. Oh, man. See, and this is what I mean by a good customer service and everything. Now, if you don't know the backstory with me and Mermaid Whiskey, I gave her a bad review. <laughs> In all honesty, I didn't like the bath bombs. I really, oh, God, there's a big old knife over here. Don't cut yourself on that, little buddy. Um, in all honesty, I didn't like the bath bombs the way they were. They were very, like, heavily moisturized oil, and I didn't like it. So I said it, and I voiced my opinion, and she found out. Of course, she watched my channel, and she found out how I felt and everything, and we, sto we spoke, and we talked back and forth, and she said, you know something? She said, I'm not too happy with it either. Um, I'm going to change it. And I said, great. When you change it, let me know, and I will, uh, I will be back on board. I'll purchase, and you know, we'll, we'll see if we get some re redemption going on there. So what I did was when she told me she was ready, I got a whole bunch of the new style bath bombs. Oh my god, were they amazing. Sorry, I, I love doing that. I love just breaking the, the peanuts. I want these pink peanuts, so I shouldn't break these. I like these. But, uh... Do you ever do this? Like, you ever find the one peanut that does not look like the other peanuts? <laughs> That's just, I, it, there's another one. They just don't look like the other peanut. <laughs> Here's the big peanut. But, uh, and he's over here having a blast with his strings. His worms. Don't swallow, dude. Come on. All right. But, uh, so I gave it a bad review. We talked. When she was ready and she had the new formula down, she uh, told me she was ready. I bought a whole mess load of them off of. And that was that big box that you guys watched me unbox a while back. And I have been demoing them ever since. And the first bath bomb that I did that she changed, holy fucking shit. She made everything that I enjoy about bath bombs. She gave the perfect show. It floats, it foams, it bubbles, and it feels amazing. So, yeah, she definitely got herself to redemption and really earned herself a spot in the Great Wall of Links that, that I, I hold in such high regards in my Dropbox there. So, this is one of my top favorite companies now because she created the bath bombs in what I wanted, in what I liked. I mean, I know a lot of us go for that same type of show bomb, but then there were some of us that didn't want that and just like that heavy moisture. But, nah, I, I, was, I was more than blown the fuck away by how good they were. And, like, I went nuts, and I was like, oh, my God, they're so fucking awesome. So, yeah, I still have them, and I do demo them, you know, throughout the week. Like, I'll grab, like, one or two and demo and try and add them in, and they're just so perfect. I really, really, really enjoy the new style of bomb. So she has become one of my top companies that I recommend everywhere. Dude, you're making a mess here. Okay, that I totally recommend everywhere and for everybody to jump on. She has not made a scent that I didn't like. She has not made a style that I haven't liked. She's done everything perfect, and now I get to try her sugar scrub. Oh, my God. The scent on the sugar scrub is amazing. I can't get over how good that pumpkin scent is. And I have pumpkin scented oils. I have uh, one that my friend sent me, and then I have two that I purchased because I like that pumpkin smell. And none of them smell like that one. That one has, it's not spicy, spicy. It's got a pumpkin spice to it, but it's sweet. So it has that, like, nice, like, as if you actually sat there and creamed pumpkin, you know? Like, that's what it smells like. It smells so good. I love Becky. Oh, my God, I can't wait to go scrub with that. All right, guys, I am going to get ready to go film a bath for you. Uh, it might take a little bit because I'm trying to watch uh, The Coven for American Horror Story. Just because I was really kind of disappointed with The Walking Dead. It was too gross, too gory. And uh, it, it just wasn't. Ugh, the Gwen scene was... Ugh. Plus I wasn't feeling good, so I almost threw up at that point. But uh, <laughs> I'm trying to get my mind off it. Uh, and they killed off one of the big players in Walking Dead, so I, I kind of don't want to watch it anymore. They like ruined my Walking Dead dreams, and they stole my Daryl. So I don't know if Daryl's going to be there. But... Thank you, Katrina. From the bottom of my heart, definitely thank you. This was an amazing, an amazing treat to get, especially when I don't feel good. Oh, my God, and I have the mob wife. Uh, I'm popping the peanuts, actually. <laughs> I have the mob wife in the melter right now, and it is slowly melting down, and it smells so friggin' good. I cannot wait for it to fill the room. And it definitely smells really good already. Here, let me show you. See, it's slowly melting down. And I can smell it already. Like, I can smell it hitting my face, like... 
So it has a really good scent throw to it. I like that one. I got. Where's the name of that one again? What was the company? House of Phoebe. It was House of Phoebe that I have in there right now. I like House of Phoebe. Uh, so far, yeah. Oh, hell yeah. I like House of Phoebe. I can't wait to try the Pink Mermaid Wax. Okay, guys. I love yous all. And a great big thank you to the folks at Whiskey Mermaid and to Katrina, the owner. I am just overjoyed and happy that you sent me this goodie box. And I really, really thank you. And wow, I, I cannot wait to go play in the tub now. <laughs> I'm going to go play with my goodies. <laughs> I'm going to take my Becky with me. Becky with the good hair. <laughs> I love you. Thank you so very much. And I'll be back on shortly with a Bath Bomb demo for you. And, yeah, we'll have a good time. So, say goodnight, Oscar. Say goodnight, Oscar. Good night. Oh, whoa, peanut flick in here. What are we doing, playing soccer? Okay, love you all. Bye, guys. Thank you, uh, Mermaid Whiskey. Or Whiskey Mermaid. Ugh, here I go again. <laughs> it's, excuse me. I've had a fever. I can't shake it. <laughs> So, Whiskey Mermaid Company, thank you so very much. I am, like, so honored to have this stuff. You have no idea. And I'm definitely going to do this guy right away because he smells absolutely divine, and I cannot wait to jump in the tub with him. And then I think I might do my skull, too. What do you guys think? Yeah, I think we should do more than one tonight. Oh, hell yeah, why not? We have the time. Okay. <clears throat> I love you. I'll talk to you soon. Katrina, thank you very much. Whiskey Mermaid Company, I said it right this time. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much for sending me these goodies. And I am so ecstatic over these boxes and stuff, too. And I'm going to eat my candy and start my bath. So I love you very much, and I will talk to you soon. And I am so very grateful to this company. You have no idea. You can find them linked down below in the Great Wall of Links. She's definitely earned her spot there. And underneath those Great Wall of Links is all of my information. If you guys need to get a hold of me for anything, questions, anything like that, knock yourselves right out. I love you so much. Bye, guys.